Hello guys, this is step by step how to make a snowflake out of a sheet of paper. <clears throat> so you can get a three, I believe it's a three, I don't really know what sheet of paper this is. But you have to have a big sheet of paper. <clears throat> Alright, then you can, then you gotta, like a, make it a square. So you can have a square, you can, if you know how to make a square. Uh, or if you already have one, but you gotta do this, and then you gotta cut the upper part. <clears throat> <clears throat> gotta cut it to get a square. Then you can cut the square into smaller squares, which is what we are using. We're using a small square. <clears throat> <clears throat> um. So you start by a better atmosphere. You start by folding this. Like this, you got It's gotta be perfect at the top. Once you have it perfectly folded, you have to crease the bottom so it's just a triangle. It won't pop right back into a square like it was. So then, once you have this triangle, <clears throat> you gotta fold it like this to make it an even smaller triangle. <clears throat> oh, sorry, guys, about the voice cracking or whatever. <clears throat> So once you have this triangle, you gotta mark kind of that this is the center. This is gonna be this corner here is gonna be the bottom of your triangle. Triangle, you're a, a snowflake. <clears throat> okay, so once you have this, then you gotta fold this up so it kind of looks like that. So it's folding up, and then you gotta bring this around like this and it's gotta be <clears throat> it's gotta be as perfect as you can get it so or either wise you're gonna have it like a kind of one side awkward one side not but ish once you have that 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 done it should end up like this which i'm just gonna probably speed this up but like <clears throat> once you have it so that was this side was a bit too big, so I need to make this bigger, I believe. So now that I have this big, and I bring it in kind of like an ice cream cone. <clears throat> and there you have it. You now have a triangle. Uh, I have a second one here. Um, but now that you have this triangle. You can cut whatever shape your desire is, but um, <clears throat> I got scissors here. These are actually the same scissors I used to make my boats, my carpet ships. But um, you gotta cut this off. Or I don't know if you have to, because I'm not the creator of these snowflakes. I'm just doing. But you gotta cut it in like a straight line. <clears throat> so like this, it comes like it's on the screen. You gotta cut it like that. Um, and yeah, once you have it removed, you'll see you have a lot of paper, you can just dispose of this. I'm gonna place it on this bigger part that's gonna be a snowflake eventually. <clears throat> but now that you have this little piece, if you wanna make a little hole in the bottom, like in the center of the snowflake, uh, you cut, like, is on shown on camera, like a little circle whatever or, or if you want it to be a circle if you want any shape you, you can have it to any shape of your desire uh if it can fit on the bottom of your triangle that is okay so online it's going to be like a square center and now all you need to do is cut like your decorations into the side and i won't give you a follow along but you can just uh just place it may just make sure it's even because snowflakes are normally even but, like, you can put some design circles, triangles, whatever you want into the side. And then, once I have that done, I'll show you how to finish the snowflake off. Okay, so once you have all the cuts and thick trims to your desire, you start to unfold it. <clears throat> so, you just unfold it. And it should... Okay, so this is what it looks like in half, and this is what the whole thing looks like. So I did kind of mess it up because it's not perfectly like round. <clears throat> it kind of looks 
like a car tire. But, uh, yeah, that's what it uh, looks like, basically. Uh, I might do it to this one so you guys can um, see what it looks like if you, if you did the steps maybe right. Because it's got to be perfectly even. There's got to be no, like, thin spots. There's got to be no little thin, skinny spots there. You got to have it... Like I had a thin skinny spot on that on the on this snowflake, but uh, I didn't have any thin skinny spot on this snowflake or this one. <clears throat> but uh, let's cut some shapes and unfold it. Mm. Okay, so this one it actually looks kind of funny when it's like this, but uh, let's see how this one turns out. Let's fold it in, huh? Already looking good. <clears throat> Now let's fold it, uh, or unfold it again. Okay, actually that looks kind of good. And then the last unfold. And... I guess they do just end up like this. But uh, this is your masterpiece. This is another one. Another epic snowflake. So yeah, this is... You can do whatever shape and design. I just did like a straight little cut in the side of it to get the like a arrow kind of effect going down and down here. On this one, I specifically did it. It goes up on one way, down on the other. And that is how you make snowflakes.